Hello, this is my token support, and I'll be showing you how to configure Radius clients to the my token server. So the first thing you want to do is create or edit a connection request policy. This can be done by accessing this application, which is the my token UI helper, and then you want to go to NPS local drop down drop down policies and then go to connection request policies once you are at this window you want to right click use windows authentication for all users and then select properties from here you have to go to settings and authentication and ensure that authenticate request on this server is enabled. Then click apply and OK. The next thing you want to do is go to network policies ready and then right click connections to other access servers and then select properties. Once you are here you want to en enable grant access and ensure that it's selected and once this is done, go to constraints and authentication methods. And here you want to ensure that unencrypted authentication is enabled. This however is still secure as you use a secret key within the radius clients. So once that's enabled, click apply and OK. Once that is all done, you want to enable a connection request policy. This is done by going to my token local here, drop down, and then click connection request policies. Here you will see use Windows authentication for all users. You want to click this and right click it and select enable my token. I have it already enabled on this system, so it'll, it says disable. But if you're enabling it for the first time, it will say enable. Once that's clicked, you should see over here it will say my token enabled. After that is done, you want to add the radius clients to this system. So you want to go to here, radius clients and servers, drop that down and click radius clients. Once you are here, you want to click new and fill in the details regarding any name, the address of the radius client and the shared secret between this server and the radius client and you have to make sure that they are both the same otherwise this wouldn't work and then click OK and you have to continue doing this for all the clients that you want to do. Here I have the server as a client of radius I have two other server two other systems as well and to test the system to see if it works you can go to radius tester fill in the details of the server the secret and their active directory password of any of the users that you're testing and then put in a token here I have a desktop token which I'm going to be using to test two zero three five six and here it says access accept which means the radius system works and my token works itself if I were to put a wrong one, I would say reject. If you have any more questions about the system or setup, just contact support at mytoken.com through email. Thank you.